Ciao guys and welcome back, it's your friend Luca and in today's video I'm really excited mostly because I found it! Probably the best medium sized camera backpack. Unbelievable. Stay tuned. Before we start I would like to say thank you to Tarion because they sent me this uh, unit to make a review about it but I want to say that I'm extremely happy and excited about this backpack because it's uh, really worth it and I think this is one of the best medium sized backpack you can find and considering the price point that they sell it I think it's a real uh, must buy for all of us. I've been searching for this type of backpack probably for 3 months because I wasn't really happy with the Low Pro Pro Tactic 450 because that backpack is pretty heavy already without any camera equipment inside so I wanted to buy something smaller and lighter to bring always with me and you probably know that I'm a fan of the one shoulder camera bag but uh, I start to feel a little bit of uh, pain in one shoulder carrying just one uh, uh, slingshot camera bag so I wanted to find a comfortable camera backpack that uh, wouldn't weigh a lot but it also had the easy access from the side but let me explain you why this backpack is so amazing first of all the backpack is extremely comfortable even if you load it full of gear and that's a major plus in my opinion second the backpack is uh, protected against the rain because it has a nice uh, fabric that uh, doesn't absorb liquids. Third place, there is a lot of uh, space. I can easily fit my Ronin RSC2 without any problems. So if I want to bring with me extra clothes on the top department of the camera backpack, there are no problems at all. Uh, you can also place a tripod on the bottom of the backpack and that's an incredible feature about this backpack because it's not like uh, let's say, I don't know, like uh, Peak Design, Love Pro that they have uh, the side the pocket uh, in the backpack that is gonna unbalance the weight distribution of your backpack so you're gonna walk <laughs> not so greatly but with this backpack you can place the tripod on the bottom of the back so you can distribute the weight of your tripod evenly without having the problem of unbalancing the center of gravity of your back and this is an extremely good feature of this backpack I hope more manufacturers are gonna introduce this system of carrying the tripod with you because it can literally save your back. The camera gear is gonna be well protected inside the backpack because the padding is really sturdy and protective. The look and the design of this camera backpack is extremely good because I think you can work in every section of photography or filmmaking from weddings, fashion, street, urban, landscape photography literally you can use it for every application without having the problem that you're gonna look a little bit weird with a super sporty camera backpack or a super urban camera backpack uh, the look of this one it's uh, pretty neutral and uh, pretty good looking and that's extremely important because we sell visual products so it is important that we sell ourselves in a good way so we should pay attention in how we look when we go to our clients to work with. The side access is extremely comfortable, you can store your camera safely without having the problem of pulling in a weird way the camera from the backpack and you can also easy access to all the pockets once you remove the camera from the backpack and this is a great plus because at the first moment I was a little bit disappointed that this backpack had only one side access but practically it's not a problem because you can pretty much access to all your equipment from this pocket and on the other side of the backpack there is another pocket that it has a little bit a weird design because it could fit a small water bottle but not a normal big water bottle we are used to carry around so I use this uh, pocket to store my filters or the lens caps um, but I think I could fit a small water bottle without problems anyway I wouldn't recommend to carry the water bottle inside the backpack because the bottle can leak and you don't want that with the electronic devices in your backpack so all in all I'm extremely happy and satisfied with this backpack there are just two minor uh, problems but they are not really problems in my opinion because it can be fixed by ourselves the front pocket is not really secure against thieves so 
it is advice maybe to put a rope around the, the zippers in case you are walking in the city and you are afraid someone can steal your camera equipment and another little problem uh, that i found in this bag is that uh, in the side access there is not a zip because this could be a perfect place for extra sd card or uh, batteries but i don't feel comfortable to put them in this open pocket because they can fly around the backpack and if you are working as a run and gun documentary photographer or filmmaker it's not that convenient to have uh, sd cards flying in the backpack so for the rest this camera bag is uh, pretty much perfect in every aspect and i can highly recommend it if you need a new medium size and lightweight camera bag for your uh, professional gigs. I think it can be really really the definitive medium size lightweight camera backpack for our uh, camera work. So this is it for today guys, thank you so much for watching, I hope that this video review was helpful and I'll see you in the next one. Ciao!